Happy Monday, everybody. Hope you all have had a good start to your week. What I'm going to do in this video is do a uh, just a little update on the uh, Citron 2CV uh, that I started. I did an uh, intro video for it and unboxing here a few days ago. And we've gotten a good, a good amount of work done on it. There's still a good amount to go, but I thought I'd go ahead and show you what we've gotten done so far and so the first thing uh, we have gotten the the engine pretty much built there are some other parts that connect to it once it's mounted inside uh, on the chassis but um, there's the little there's the little two-cylinder engines or the two-cylinder engine uh, that this car is uh, famous for and one thing that I thought was really, really interesting is uh, how long these cars have been in production. Um, they came out in 1948, and I believe they finally stopped production on them in the early to mid-90s. Uh, and so, you know, as I said before, they were uh, pretty popular cars um, and had kind of had a long run. This particular model that I'm building, I found out, um, came out in 1985. Uh, this is an 85 model. The Dolly came out in 1985. So um, there is the the engine. Uh, tried to you know detail it up a little bit, weather it just a little bit, use some um, some silver paint to just kind of show that it's got a little bit of wear and tear on it. Um, so anyway, there's there's that. And then the next thing we got is we just got the uh, steering column and the steering wheel and um, you know the the color callouts on this are pretty basic. Um, it's, there's a lot of black, a lot of flat black, and that's just the, these cars were very basic. So um, we did put a little bit of red on the uh, on the the levers here. Uh, just to kind of give it a little bit of color um, and to kind of match what we're going to do with the body color. Uh, so there's our steering wheel, steering column. And then next we have our chassis. Uh, I'll show you the underside of it first. There's the, the bottom side. Again, just flat black. Everything's flat black. Um, then we've got our, our front axle and suspension, uh, rear axle. Um, so very, very basic. The, about the only other thing that is going to go uh, on the chassis is going to be the uh, exhaust. So we've still got to paint that and put it on. So there's the, the chassis with the, the axles and what little suspension there was. And then lastly is the part of the interior anyway. Um, of course, the, the interior uh, floors and all, it called for them to be just a, a black, flat black. So um, we've got our, our uh, seat supports in the front that are flat black. Um, and then this, these seats, I did uh, it's just a rust-oleum color, I think. I think the color call-out was for a sand color, or maybe a, um, I think it was sand. Um, but I didn't really have, you know, I don't have the Humbrol colors, so I just, uh, I picked what I thought might be close close to that. So that's, this is called Smoky Beige. I think it's a rust-oleum color. And then just to bring out, kind of bring out the, uh, the detail on the seats, it's got this great diamond pattern uh, on the seats. I, I did a little bit of a brown wash with some uh, uh, model color, the leather um, leather brown. I just watered it down a lot and and uh, and again, just to, again to show kind of some wear um, on the upholstery in this in this car. So um, there's that. Uh, of course, it's got door panels that I, I need to paint and some other little, you know, it's got a dashboard and all of that that we'll, we'll do as we go along. But 
that's about as far as we are. I'm just trying to kind of, I mean, it's it's going pretty quick, but I'm trying not to get in too much of a hurry, so I, I don't want to mess anything up. So um, these kits are not, even the this Airfix kit was not cheap, and I know the Tamiya kits for the 2CV and the Heller kits, uh, they're not cheap either. So um, I just wanted to want to kind of take my time and, and get it done as right as possible. So anyway that's that's where we're at so far on this build so um we will plug along and get some more work done and see you on the next update uh hope all of you guys that went to acme are recovering uh, from that trip sounds like it was a lot of fun uh and uh hope you all have a great week we will see you next time bye